What's up guys, this is the Braveman and I am back to bring you the next episode of my 13 Colonies Let's Play. So, to round off, to round up, actually, to round up where we left off, what I do need to do is slightly that, just a smidge, because it was really quite loud before. Um, we are laying siege to Paris and we're going to attack, but just a second, quickly before we do that... Um, I'm going to Settlement quickly fill out a Patreon name request uh, to, name an, to name a cavalry unit. The first troop Philadelphia City Cavalry for a cavalry unit. I think we're going to call it the Hussars. Rename it the Hussars. So it's the first troop. Okay, let's get rid of it. This troop. Left out. Mm, can't have Philadelphia City. Okay, let's. I'm fairly sure. Shorthand. First troop. Philadelphia City. Cavalry. Ah! Oh, so let's get rid of. Comma. So I think I'm gonna can't get it all in. So I think I'm call it the first Philadelphia City Cavalry. So apologies for not being able to get it all in. Uh, due to the character, then we have to do a bit of wordsmithing. Because um, to me, that looks pretty, pretty set and pretty. It's a nice format. I think it looks it looks nice. Uh, anyway, back to where we were with our new the first Philadelphia City Cavalry. We're going to assault the city of Paris. It should be. We have to move up fast because they've got mortars, but it's lots of pretty chaff infantry and far calm citizenry. So let us attack. So we have previous outside Paris. So I'd be very, very keen to get in, take the city, and fortify. That's what I want. Because we are, in Colonies Campaign, we are at war with many, many many European powers. So being able to knock out the... Well, not, being able to knock out the French, quote-unquote, uh, is like House Lorraine, Amsterdam. Ooh, this is quite good. So let's get our artillery up on the hill behind our line. House is behind, I've been told. Carcass shot's meant to be like similar to quickline, but just not quite as effective, so let's try that. So let's create a giant battle line except for the 36th <laughs> everyone else this is going to be this is a blunt a blunt attack but I think it's worth doing the reason why is because my plan will be to just to rapidly envelop that army around the flanks so let's put the second Dreadnought Regiment on the right. First Philadelphia on the left. Jump in the centre. Cavalry's going to be shot at first. Artillery. Engage their artillery. Houses cannot really engage. Hey, that did pretty good. Okay, let's run our infantry up. We need to make rapid progress. Whoa, damn. Their artillery is in quite a good spot upon this hill. But it prevents me from directly charging them. I have to go around. Tenth is getting absolutely smacked. My guys are going to be very tired. 
Hey, let's demolish a building, knock out three guns in the process. up into firing positions right in their face. We haven't got time or the luxury to sit back as so we'll take some risks. It's got the fillies. Let's run you around this militia that's coming up to meet you. Let's try a similar strategy against them. If we can demolish this building and knock out some guns. Let's run the missiles in. Around the rear. So we've stormed up. We've stolen the march on their cavalry. On their infantry, rather. The first job of the first Philadelphia City Cavalry is a kind of a suicide mission. <laughs> Not a suicide mission, it's a, it's a sprint. That's what it is. Good, they're being broken down by our superior infantry drills. It's unlimber how it's wherever they are now. They would be nice to kill, but they're all lots of chaff. Wait, well, then for a second I thought a militia unit went pro. Let's change the target of our guns. Against that, they're going for our cavalry. Carcass shots coming in against the guns, so let's retarget you. Their infantry drills. They, well, the French now have infantry drills, advanced infantry drills researched. Push up. Oh, come here. Don't run around here to do whatever you were doing. Mortar on the left. Not mortar. How it's there? Done a good job on them. Dangerous things happening with our, with our artillery. Let's run you around to the front of these buildings to provide fire. Let's get recovery. First Phillies to hit 13th Regiment foot. Ah. Come on, Hazars. Go, go, Gadget Amadeus Crisp. 
Dreadnoughts have done quite well. Dreadnoughts come down here, over here to chase down the militia. is engaging someone else like them. Just go for kills. That's the priority. So that flank is shattered. So they're going to rout? Yeah, they're going to rout. So go after the armed citizenry. Broken two. No doubt they'll still be there by the time you get there, but yep. Yeah. Let's hope that artillery. You can see it smashing into the arms, it's nice up north, and coincidentally with cavalry. Having a grand old time. Okay, let's go after a unit that's not bugged out on furniture. As they scythe down these Frenchmen. It's a hot fire with the artillery, too. They're going to rout, so I'm not going to bother about them. See who takes the glory from this field. Ah, Medeus, there's none left for you. Philadelphia's up to rank four. Too bad they try to charge my the unit, my guards are nearby here, aren't they? Yeah, line infantry guards. Get him back. Let's continue. Let's mine some. Let's do a bit of a bit of experience mining. Because enough to do to get some. And it's not a city battle, so there's nothing funky. It's just a simple old. Amadeus Crisp isn't getting any, but he might get some from the scale of the victory. So the Philadelphia's doing great to the north. Dreadnoughts have charged in. Oh yes, they have managed to shepherd them away from the... from the line. Oh yeah, you're ready. We are finished. My cavalry charge in. Excellent. See, this is, this is kind of how it's supposed to work. Beautiful stuff. Good. For a minute I was looking like there's no flag, but he's on the map. Damn right, decisive victory. Good. And 422 men it took to secure the city. This army that would not have been any help at all. Make ready. Mark. Okay, exempt from tax. Not done the college. You might have two. Your Majesty? I mean, you might have to fall back to here Immediate. so you don't get. Yes, my lord. Oh, gee, I might even do this. You ask too much. So we send them from taxes, and if we knock down the school, then, then, then they would survive it. But the question now is how long can they hold? War with Poland. So you're gonna 
Gorillas be heavy cavalry. I actually like my heavy cavalry's chances. Zagreb will be fortified a couple of turns. Venice is getting a garrison because the Polish the drive the Polish drive west is a concern. This artillery fort, I'm pretty I feel pretty good about you. This is is a scary problem. In turn. Oh, the British are coming. Don't, don't, don't go for me, France, please. Oh, the Spanish declared on me. Everyone, come in and help. So that also means war in Europe has kicked off. It's the Poles. What are the Poles going to do? It caused me some problems in the mid. Oh god. Yeah, right away. The Russians are. Oh, if the Russians take out Sarajevo, they will not. But the Ottomans, they'll have caused the Ottomans to not really be that much of a major threat. And the Westphalians haven't moved either. So, so the hope is our damaged stack can head northeast to the bridge to hold off the Westphalians. The ruling classes have written a letter of demands to your national leader, as they are unhappy with the current government. You'll be okay. Failure to comply will lead to an organized rebellion against you. Acquiescence at this stage could lead to further demands. Yeah, but we've destroyed the school, so no learning for you guys. Let's replenish and set you up here. Onward. The fort would be nice, but they'd intercept us. So you're yes. replenishing. Weirdly, do I try and get peace with France? Aha! Perfect. They hate us, but we are allies. So the question is, do we march you down and start tangling with the Spanish? Because I would love, 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 love to tax the French. Let's do some raiding. Let's raid there. Raid the farm. I might send them to the south. Because now we're at made peace with the French. I feel okay about that. The Poles are a bit of a problem because that's a really, really decent looking army. Mulan's Regiment of Horse. So this, this, this is my Alamo. If they breach through here, I mean, this is a real problem. One more turn till this is fortified, which I think would be really hard to take. But then again, you've got three stacks. Three stacks, lots of cavalry. So my heavy cavalry to chase down there. Guerrillas. Yep. Not surprised about that. So we've got a school in Florence, we don't need to worry about the loss of the one in Paris as much. Everything's going to take forever to research because it's so small. Go for copper bottoms. Workers are on strike, then they're going to riot next turn. But we'll be alive. That's the, the key takeaway. Now, we're at war with the Spanish. Does that also mean... No, it does not mean New Spain. It is just... The Spanish incontinent. That does also mean you, with your annoying little army of conscripts. That's 39,000. On the 4th, 39,000 next turn. So if you're safe with you, you'll be able to rebuff an 
a one or two stacks in one battle, two one after another, but if it's in three, things are dodgy. So who are the poles? Oh god alive. Okay. Who against who are the poles at war with? Please don't just be me. Cherokee, New Spain, 13 colonies. Damn! They're just after the colonial powers and I'm... Well, they're only, they're only after the war with the colonies and I'm the only colony they've got to fight. This is going to be tricky. Let's push the militia out to, to Fort Moncton. Anything more? Third rate ship line here, so we're starting to build up our navy. Cannot give her an admiral yet. Need to engage this Polish navy. Yeah, Russians are doing okay. They're not. They've not got. An, they've not got a navy, so they're not. They're not going to go after Patras. Uh, so Spain is with me and Great Britain. Just us. Great. I mean, Spain's not a very big region. That's it. Well, a lot of territories, but that that could be annoying wherever you choose to sail, such as, well, actually, doing pretty good. Um, sit in turn. See, uh, spies are on the move. Spies are going to become so important. So the Westphalians could come after us. So, but this is the this is the clincher. What are you gonna do? Croatia's got one turn until the war. Oh, oh, so they've gone. Okay. Ah, oh, dang it! Defensive battle it is with no fortifications against acquired. Then again, six pounder. Demi cannons. We're going to shoot the hell out of them with artillery. Well, to a degree. But they're going to come in from the left, so we want to. almost behind us, actually. Or directly to the left. We will be formed up. They'll be marching to the battle, so they're not going to have a battle line set up and everything will be okay. This is an opportunity to chew up two strong forces heading towards Venice. So even if we lose this fight. Um, we will still aid the difference. So they're going to come from up over here, almost directly to the left. Which is all to the good, because we've got a brilliant position! So they'd have to go all the way around, or something like that. I, from my guesses. Let's get our foot artillery up here. Let's got howitzers back here, because they can fight over hills. So let's build a defensive line. This is all on the supposition that my theory is... My, my plans are in any way accurate. And what I would like... Gonna go, these guys are going to go back here to try and deploy up around here to at least secure this part. Then I've got left over. Two, three, four, five. Not you. Deploy out front the stakes. General in the rear. To be honest, they might just deploy over here instead. These guys are going to be the operational reserve. I might put one foot unit up here just to... Just to tango.
They're firing at each other. So they might slightly catch us on the hop, but... So long, Lancers. Yeah, they are shooting each other. Oh no, wait, counter battery. There's counter, there's artillery fire. Where, 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 where? All the way over here. No way, they must be shooting each other. for the love of God. Let's kill some generals. Killed one. Parker shot came in. Killed two. So also they might send someone up to try to kill my artillery after all. Oh no, is it you? No, they're not even firing. Has their artillery started firing? Yep. Ah, oh, they're just out of range of my houses. Oh, they're limbering up anyway. Focus fire on these guys. Got a shot. Yeah, this does really good. Thank you. Another point out. Oh, that missed. That's terrible. Oh, God. Stuff staying square. Good morning, Lance. Square, bizarrely. Cavalry is still coming in. This time it's dragoons. Both of the folks fire this unit of line infantry. Get out, get reloaded, get shooting. Still do have some reserves, and to be honest, I might just take these guys and curve them. Put, put them down here. Hey, the cavalry's back. There's a line infantry coming out. I 
Okay, we need to kill these Marines. My line infantry should be the Marines. Guns to hit demi cannons because they've now entered the range. Come on. able to punish them as much as I would normally because uh, I've not, not got very I haven't got very much cavalry I can get this guy over here firing over the heads of the troops or even like here Stop, we're giving them a taste of what it's like to fight. Uh oh. They're coming right for us. Killed some of their cover. Oh! That's the game you want to play, eh? Misses on the demi cannons. Retarget with our fire. There we go, because the high advantage. Safely fire over the heads of our own men. So the amount of firepower putting out here is ridiculous. Oh, my units can stay in their positions. This is working all right. Artillery is falling back out of range, so they go. F you go for that unit of horse artillery instead. training team, man. The cavalry's charging in. Get the wrath of the four foot guards before they get into combat. They've done it again! Charged into point blank range. Doing something that would look pretty devastating. And then at the last minute gone. Okay, one of you go after that unit of Marines and 
another V go off there. Let's shoot at Marines. Sure. Oh, they're out of range. That's why. One of the cav one of the artillery pieces on the move. So most of their garrison guards are dead. Few are wholly on. As the Marines get shot down. Late Marines on the flank might actually do not that bad. Okay, but will these guys do what the other guys do? Yes, god damn it. How are you conquering your opponent if this is your job? You're sneaking your running dragoons up right into our faces. Providing horsey shields for everyone. See, they might, these marines, they might actually do not too terribly, because lots of the... Like, I've already got the marines matched, both in terms of roughly size and experience. And we've also got a couple of other footline units that can get both of them. Artillery shells are bouncing near their horse artillery. I have yet still to, to, to provide a significant breakthrough. As more cavalry joins the field. Odds on of these guys doing the exact same thing. Oh, like, they've stopped charging. What? No, not for them. Can these infantry have made it in position? Pretty intact. No, yeah, not anymore. Cavalry charging in single file. God damn, that's so if God if they that one that hit short. If it was just a bit longer, it would have taken him out. This close, there might be some fratricide, but yeah, there is. But it's worth it for the destruction of the troop. See, look how close the shells are getting. We still can't get them. Lancers, lancers. I feel left in reserve, you know, dragoons. Say if these cavalry do it again. Oh no, wait, these are lancers! <laughs> Quite the opposite. So they run along the line. 
To be honest, that's stupid old switcheroo. Pull those guys out of the line, put the stronger formations in the line. Oh, yes! They picked just the right direction. And on the way back as well. That is lovely. We have lost a unit of infantry. See the fellas. I think it's a bit of fratricide from them. Is the Indian Marines that was... Well, it must be, this must be the original Marines. They've, they've stuck it out remarkably well. Hey, there's a regiment of horse coming around the rear. Okay, you two weaker units, go up here. Trying to flank me. Ain't gonna work. No siree. I mean, this gun crew needs to get whatever the Polish version of the Victoria Cross or the Medal of Honor is. These dragoons are going to hit the spikes. Only a bit. Form square. Aim at the demi, demi cannons on the ridge. Could send a unit of line infantry to get deal with them. Driven them back. Shoot them, man. Shuffled around. Ah, try it on again. As we tear the Polish cavalry off from, out from the saddle, this gun team is about to get charged by the 60th. At least that's the Polish artillery team destroyed. Only well, one of the only units left. Battery reporting. All of our artillery have a pop because they're bugged. It's a speed up time. I suspect a few artillery shots would be enough to send them packing. Considering the rest of their army has fled the field. Wavering, shaken, wavering. I mean, I will trot some artillery, my cavalry towards you. Good. End battle. Heroic victory for. Dosh Garnet. Um, but we lost a lot of men, but they lost even more. So you're gone. 
you now cease to be too much of an important threat. And now Croatia is fortified. I mean, I could intercept. Oh, I could provoke them to attack me again. Although, actually, no. No, that's a bit of a mess. That's two armies of yours I've destroyed, and do you fancy some more? Because I don't think you do. Once I've dealt with Spain, I'll be coming after you. Because I don't think the truce with France is going to last very long, so I want to keep Paris fortified. But I want to send armies south, take out Madrid, Lisbon, quickly. Rioting has broken out in this region as the hey. lower orders have become too unhappy. Protestant missionary. You must either appease the rioters. Oh no, but I'm sure they're not rioting anymore. No, they are not. Okay, so. My first missionary can come down to that Naples and start the conversion. Actually, Naples has. No, Naples has a college of divinity, yes. so does Rome. As you to Genoa! Venice is being converted. You are now fortified, so let's replenish you guys. Uh, can we just get the Westphalians out of our territory? No, I'm not giving you Trinidad. Make ready. Let's keep you replenishing it. Let's get a unit of just infantry. Can I tax you now? Yes, we can. Okay, so France is a very, very wealthy region. What roads have you got? Okay, you're getting mild roads. You're all getting upgraded to a. Oh, yes, you'll have all sorts of religious buildings, won't you? Seminary. Gone. Pleasure House is currently being destroyed. Let's rebuild the Weaver's Cottage. Let's rebuild the commercial port. Let's put a church school to start to pump out some Protestants. Replenish the army. Good. Can we even trade with them? No trade. So the Poles are here. You're reinforcing. Your garrison is growing. And I would probably like to add some more infantry. So that's quite a really good garrison for Venice. So you're a frustration, but not much more than that. So they're just heading to port. Yep, they're both dead. Well, they were dead anyway. Not anymore, it appears. Don't like I can't see you anymore. The conscript navy Even army. Way, okay, they're still there. Yes, your majesty. Wicked. So you raid. Raid. Oh, let's bring. Bring Andrew Hamilton south. Let's march on towards Madrid and see what's going on. Lots of things have been built. 51,000 next turn. That is what we're talking about. So one more in turn. And then if nothing starting happens, um, I'll probably send that army to go hit the Westphalian position. 51 grand is a lot, a lot of cash. Especially the Spanish leave, or maybe, well, I doubt Druid unprotected. If they have, then holy moly, that's a lot of money. So they're bringing reinforcements to my front. Oh, the Bavarians have rebelled. Sadly, they've been put down. The Austrians are rebelling. Rebellions are good, it's keeping them occupied rather than. Wasted troops on me. Do 
I mean, oh, which is Russian, Poland are allies, so I can't count on them. Prussia might be useful. To maintain as an ally. Okay. So there is a port in this region that has not yet been so you've developed. Gone, my spies made Select it to Bavaria. Okay, so now it's gonna start telling me all the things I can upgrade. And it's lots. It really is lots. So let's move a Stragoon unit up to Paris. And Let's build this is a craft workshop. Ooh, good dockyard. So let's record. Let's, get, let's build a sloop just to keep it secure. Let's send our yes, cavalry sir. up. Any further orders? So Madrid's got a double stack. It's got a couple of bandido, banditos. Royal Halberdier Guard. I mean, they're just melee infantry. I don't know if they've got swords. Like, no, it just looks like they've got a pike. Commercial bases have been built. Where's La Havre? There you go. Let's build that because it's giving us warnings to the Lord. Forward. Okay, Mark. you are ready. So then, in Paris, let's go for an army board. Your roads are being built. Let's build the theatre just to keep them happy or even happier. A sloop. In Rome, let's recruit General's bodyguard. Ooh, we can get lifeguards now. But I'd like to get. So you got seconds, thirds, Admiral's flagship first, two heavies. Good. Let's upgrade. Naples roads is a good idea. Lots of recruitment in Venice. So now Venice is. I'm feeling pretty safe. I'd be pretty safe with that as a garrison, especially against a depleted troop like this. And eventually, this army will form up to be a proper army, and I'll push east. Okay. So but looking at the timer, we're at the end of the at part, the so what I'm going to do to tee up the action for the next part is to assault hey, over, Robert. and let's get ready to crush the last Westphalian troops against us. But like I said, it's the end of the turn, so, end of the part. So, thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed, and we'll see you next time.